My practice is like a container, like a vessel. As I grew into myself as a man and as an adult, I started to use my body as that vessel to put together various aspects of creative languages together in which performance that comes from the theater and this idea of creating this world and universe of make-believe and storytelling in real time directly comes in contact with painting and the act and the process of making an image and the storytelling that happens in that. While I was very present in my performances, I felt that I needed to create that kind of presence on a two-dimensional surface, but in the need to create within the boundaries of a painting a complete sense of presence, I felt the need to look at this expanding archive of performances and pick moments from these performances that I've done here in Paris and France that were about acceptance, submission, and placing them in a completely reconstructed narrative where the landscapes are imagined. And in a way, what's happening for me is that I am thinking a lot about the presence of the body in landscape. In that search, I've been sort of thinking about inviting a pose into the drawing. So this world of the painting becomes an infinite set of possibilities for me that I'm very happy to unpack now. Every single work in this exhibition is made here in the past six months. I have kind of isolated myself in this studio at the Cité des Arts to seep in. So I'm thinking about the role of fire through this residency. In my previous engagement with elements of a landscape, I was thinking a lot about land, water and sky. Fire, essentially, as an element, was, was clearly missing. And in a sense, it directly translated into the soft blues of my landscapes that I've been so indulging in over the years. I feel that the red in that blue has finally kind of entered as a flame because life is burning and it is from heat. And I really do feel that fire has really been the element that has allowed us to proliferate on this planet, but is also an element that is going to contribute to our destruction. When I look at a landscape now, I look at it as scarred, as burnt, as wounded. And these wounds, in a sense, are also corporeal. So I think fire is the one that connects body to landscape. It's important that I remind myself and people who come in contact with the work that there is process behind this. And that process is the movement of the body. In that, I am keen most of the times to make people aware of their own presence. And in that awareness, there is then the critical space that I get to enter. So I think to layer the politics of what it is that I'm doing within these drawings, it's important to look at the performances. I borrow and I take from the theater just as much as I take from painting. And costuming or creating a persona actually allows me to step out of my daily, ordinary self and place myself in an extraordinary situation and allow for another being, in a sense, to enter and from that place make the drawings. And this is something that I'm like constantly wanting to push is what is the extent of who I am and what is it to the extent of then who you are? And that else is only discovered, as far as I'm concerned, in the live space. And in a way, that is the pursuit, is to, to flip the inside out.
largely towards the end of the performances. There is a sense of wanting to exit the performance. And in that moment, I find myself really submitting to the moment wholly, forgetting myself as Nikhil, as the son of, as the father of, as the husband of. So none of these things matter anymore. And there is this complete submission to the idea of making the image and making the picture and telling the story.